Good morning, friends. Wow, what a beautiful uh, day, you know, to celebrate the Maya New Year, always with a beautiful sun in the Yucatan, giving us the opportunity to connect with our father's song, the life, and especially to, to really feel in our hearts the connection with our mother for all the gifts, for all the graces, uh, and for all the love that, that she's present to us. So we are now in, in the first days, you know, where we're going now from the 19th to the 25th, 25th of July, who is, uh, you know, we can say the first week connected with these days. And uh, in this time, uh, you know, uh, when you arrive to the cosmic universities, you are a student and, and you receive the guidance of your teachers. So there is a, there is a, a beautiful sorry that um i don't know can you hear me you're frozen they call the pin special explain how can you do in your own home yes i can okay because now you froze they, and we couldn't hear anything that is the connection is unstable for a moment ah, okay okay so shall we just try again okay okay hold on a sec Good morning, friends. How are you? Always a pleasure to say hello from the land of the Mayab, and very happy to have had the days of the Maya New Year. And now we're preparing, you know, in these days to begin our next our next days in this uh, beautiful year. Now the dates are going from the 19th to the 25th of July, 2020. And I would like to introduce these days with the opportunity to tell you something about the they call the sacred transmission of the holy core the holy core the, the mayans conceive the time and space like a core like a rope and in this rope the mayas uh, uh, invited their students to go to a chamber you can do in your own in your own place in your own room with your groups you have groups inviting them uh, to get a a uh, piece of coal like this. And what is the purpose? The purpose is to, in meditation, each one of them can do uh, like a little knot, tidying a purpose. Like, my purpose is progress in my job, you know. So I, I tie the first one. And then I continue in my meditation, and then I do another one who is I want to be healed in this area of my body. It's another one. And then so on. So you can tie as, as many thoughts, as many knots you need it. What is the purpose? The purpose is that anytime you see this, and in the Mayan times they have their own rooms, they, the row was made of henneken or sisal, who is a very resistant cactus we have in Yucatan. You always see them and say, oh, what happened with my first knot? Uh, what happened about my job? What happened about my healing? What happened about the, my house? What happened about this and that? So this is the purpose. And then with that, you, in the moment when you solve it, you can open the knot, you know, and say, okay, so I solved this. So the first knot connecting, you know, with my job as an example is solved. So I dissolve the first knot and go on. So this is a kind of a retrospection, feedback, that you, over the year, you can check it, what, what's going on, what happened with you. So this is why the Mayans have a day, that the day is called Lamat, Lamat, L-A-M-A-T, and means union, you know, the union. So this is very important to remember that the union with all uh, everything in one purpose, everything in one knot, everything in one rope, who represents your own connection. Remember too that the Mayas connected the robes and the cores with the energy of the sun, the energy Kundalini, 
the energy all the, the 365 days. So let's do the meditation connecting with that idea, you know, for, uh, for your own practices, you can do it, you can suggest it to your groups, you can guide it, you know, yourself for you and then for the groups in order that we can apply this first practice exercise uh, calling, you know, the Holy Core. So let's, let's do our meditation connecting with this specific exercise. In this case, we're going to do without it, but then you can guide a meditation in the same way. Let's close our eyes. We say now, Father, Mother, out of the sky, out of the earth, thank you for to bring us to the Maya New Year, safe, with life, in balance, in family, with my friends, having the support to live, opening new doors, new windows. But I want to do an especial emphasis in this moment, in this meditation, to asking you to open my heart, to open my thoughts, to be guided, to be protected, to receive the knowledge, to receive the wisdom. What are my main objectives, purposes, and necessities for this year? We can go for one, imagining you have your cord. The white cord represents, as I, as I told you, the energy of the sun connecting with the light, the wisdom. And in the example that I gave you, you're going to make the first note, and we're going to take an example by healing. Healing, balance, and harmony. Healing, balance, and harmony. My first note, my first thought, that I'm going to do in my, in my court, in my role. So we ask again to the Holy Spirit, and Father, Mother, especially to Father, Son, Mother, Mother Earth, shell, to bring us these three things, the healing for our body, our organs, our thoughts, our soul, the healing for all that we are, our cells, molecules, systems, and at the same time, they harmonize, to harmonize and balance body, soul, and spirit as one, guided by you. Guided by you, Father, Mother. Then we are going to pronounce the mantra, Lama. Means the union, the link, in one robe, in one core, in one holy core, connecting with its purpose. The Maya New Year. Lama, 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 Our purpose of the life, if you have goals, whatever you think is your mission is available to you, make the notes. The serpent of light, 
connecting with the energy of the sound, the wisdom, the energy of the mother are with you in these states to make possible to connect deeply in your heart, deeply in your mind with the Maya New Year purposes and to have a straight path, a sack bay, a white road that you can walk in a certain direction to know where you're going to know what are your goals, what do you need in your physical, in your soul, in your spirit, in your healing, in your different aspects, material and spiritual. The road will guide you, always connected with Father Mother's will. There are your guides, your parents, that they love you unconditionally. Surrender your will always to begin a new day, a new schedule, a new process. And the notes and the core will remind you the purpose, your mission, your goals in this time. Let's do again our mantra, Lama. same way we can send this holy holy cord to make the union between all humankind with the purpose to help us each other to support each other as a humankind as brothers and sisters and remember instead of the, the division instead of divide to put together as in the core, as a symbol, countries, people, Mother Nature, Mother Earth, all mountains, rivers, waterfalls, crystals, caves, mountains, seas, lakes, all the beauty, the snow, the rain, are in one core. The core belongs to Father, heart of the sky, and the Mother, heart of the earth, to be with you. To send love and light, abundance, harmony, peace, healing, kindness to all our planet and to all the living beings. So it is, so it is, it is done. So it is, so it is, it is done. In Lakesh, Alake. Take a breath. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Say thank you to your personal teachers your personal guides, spiritual guides, father and mother, Holy Spirit, thank you for this guidance to the Maya New Year. Guide us and remember us the beautiful golden cord that you are linked with us. You can open your eyes. Remember, symbols are reminding 
of our purpose. Whatever symbol we, we use it, we just follow according with our own purposes and things will happen in that way. Thank you and have a beautiful day in La Cree.